Okay, YouTubers, it's Friday the 24th of May, time for physics fun. What am I doing today? Oh, it's the, uh, it's the exam today, isn't it? For the A-level students, they're all sat there working away really hard. And what am I doing when I'm doing a little bit of fun physics? Um, so I've got a ray box. It's got all these really cool lines. But actually, they're not just like dots. They're actually kind of flat lines, which is kind of clever. And I can do something cool with what I've got here. So what I've got here is just a plastic bag, a clip, some water. So I've made it curve. Go around a little bit. Can you see there's a curve to it? It's not quite perfect, but I'm going to kind of use it to be like a lens, is the idea. So we can take the ray box and I can put it through if I move around a little bit. Can you see how you've got flat lines? Now they should all be parallel. If I turn it this way, you will see they're not parallel, are they? So they should go straight through if they were um, not refracted, but they are refracted. So they're actually being brought to a focal point because this is a converging lens, isn't it? So converging lens. So when you ask the question, is it concave or convex? Well, concave goes in like a cave, convex will curve. So this is by convex because it curves on both sides. And so it's focusing the light, isn't it? I can change my signal so we can have just one beam there. I can move it around. You can see how it changes. So when it's like this, it's always going straight through. Hard to see from my angle. Um, and then as I move up, it bends, doesn't it? But if I put the extra signal on, I can have different ones. You can end up seeing how it's actually focusing them to a point. Okay, so there you go. So it's a really simple demo using water, which has a refractive index, which is similar to glass, but not identical. And I formed a lens. So if I show you now, let's pull it out a little bit. So it's a curve to it, isn't it? So it's just like a lens. It is focusing the light. And I could, let's just hold it up here. And you're wondering why, because it doesn't quite look like water that's got a bit of my milk and tea in there so that you can see dispersion. So I've kind of ruined it to see exactly. But if you didn't do that, you really wouldn't see these amazing lines coming down. So it's like a flat line, isn't it? So there you go, bit of physics fun on a Friday.